Hello, hello, hello! Welcome back to Naomi's Corner. Today we will be featuring a very delicious Nigerian dish, and that is the famous and delicious jollof rice. And to help us prepare that Nigerian dish, we have here our Mama Kate Isan. We call her Mama Kate to help us prepare this delicious dish. So, uh, Mama Kate, say hi to everybody. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Naomi's Corner. My name is Kate Isan, but they call me Mama Kate. I'm a Nigerian. I'm from the Delta part of Nigeria, and my husband is Yoruba. So we love jollof rice a lot, and everybody loves jollof rice. It's world famous, you know. So we're going to prepare the Nigerian way. There are other ways to prepare the Senegalese way, the Ghanaian way, but today is going to be the Nigerian way. And we're going to use Uncle Ben's rice because originally that is what we use in Nigeria for the jollof rice. So it doesn't stick. For my personal use, I use the basmati and the jasmine rice, two cups of each to do in the EOC. Because the EOC does about 400 dishes. You can fry your chicken here, you can bake your fish here, and you can do your jollof rice here, your pepper soup, your beans, whatever you want to do here, you do it here. You know, and it doesn't take long to cook. It has a timer, and uh, within a few minutes, your jollof rice is ready. Instead of spending hours doing your jollof rice, we have cut up the bell pepper, which is tatashe in Nigeria. We have cut up the tomatoes. Then we have the habanero pepper, a little ginger, and we've cut up the onions. We have bay leaf, we have the chicken broth, and then we have the tomato paste and the spices. Yes. Thyme and curry. So now I've washed the rice. It's nice and clean, and I showed, I took some of the water from washing the rice because what we do in Salad Master, we try to starch it so there's not too much starch in it. So you eat rice guilt-free, all right? So now we're going to preheat our EOC. The EOC is uh, called the electric oil core. core, okay? So you can cook your jollof rice in the EOC. This cooks about 400 different dishes, not just jollof rice. You can make your stewed beans here, your yam porridge, you're a furry roll. I'm just talking about the Nigerian dishes that are world famous. And you can also make your moi moi here. Mm. But if you want to cook larger quantity of jollof rice, then can also we use introduce to you the authentic rice cooker from Salad Master. All right. So now, Miss Naomi. Okay, so how are we going, going to, to do? Uh, we're, what going are we're going to blend do all the, this together. We're going to blend together. And we're going to dump it here, which we call the dumping method. So now we're going to open our pan to check that it's hot enough because the secret of the EOC is to preheat the pan mm -hmm. because it works like an oven, it works like a frying pan, mm -hmm. and it works like a cooking pan. Okay, so I'm going to sprinkle some water, which to we call the water the dance. Mm -hmm. So if the water is dancing, wow, you see? Wow, look at that. Water is dancing, so it's hot enough. Mm -hmm. Now we can fry. We're ready. Yeah, we're ready mm -hmm. to do our jello fry sauce. Okay. So we start with the sauce. This is a little oil. Remember I told you all that in Salad Master you can cook with little or no oil? So we're just going to put a little coconut oil because I love the coconut oil, the flavor it gives in my jello fries. Mm -hmm. Okay, but you can use any oil of your choice. So that's just a little tablespoon of cooking oil. Okay. Wow. Coconut oil. Mm -hmm. So now I'm going to pour my blended Tomatoes, Tomatoes pepper, pepper, onions, habanero. Yeah. Okay. Wow. See that? Wow. Okay. All right. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to cover it and steam it a little bit. Okay, so what we're doing here right now, we pour in all of our mixture and we're going to cook it for 10 minutes for 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Wow, now 10 minutes are up and we are ready to open our electric skillet and you can hear the magic vapor valve starts clicking. Salad master. Yes. Yeah. So what's next, Mama Kate? Okay, Miss Naomi, now that it has stopped cooking, we're going to open our pan and see. You can Ooh, see that the water has dried out. I can smell out. the habanero. <laughs> yes, we can smell the ingredients mm -hmm. already. And then we're going to add our spices. And you were telling me about why do we have to cook this first because of the tomatoes the are tomatoes fresh. tomatoes are acidic and mm -hmm. fresh mm -hmm. and you don't want acidic taste in your jello fry. I'm going to okay. put the time. Normally I don't measure, in Nigeria we don't measure, but 
for the purpose of this video, we have to measure so you can see mm -hmm. how much time. It's one teaspoon, it. right? One mm -hmm. teaspoon of thyme. Okay, so we mm -hmm. added the thyme, and next is it? two teaspoons of curry. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to add your paprika. Just to make it more red. So Ooh. we're going to add two teaspoons of the paprika. Paprika. Oh, I can paprika. smell everything and it smells really good. Okay. So right now we add the chicken beyond also. Look at that. So because it's four cups of rice, we're going to add at least two. Mm -hmm. And then taste it. If it's not enough, we can add one more. Okay. All right. Okay. And then I'm just going to stir it. So that all the spices oh my are smells in really it. good. Yes. And then we have the derica tomato paste. Derica so how much of that paste. are we going to use? We're going to use like half of this. Oh, okay. Yeah. Four. Four tablespoons. Four tablespoons. So you can always freeze the rest, it's not wasted. Mm-hmm. Stir it again. Make sure you dissolve the tomato paste so it's blended properly into the sauce. Okay. Before you add your rice. Wow. And this mixture is good for um, almost, this, this is actually four cups, right? Four cups of four rice, cups yes. Of rice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We're going to cover it to cook a bit so that all the ingredients are in. Oh, okay. So mm. for another, uh, how much? Five minutes. Five more minutes for yes. 350 degrees. Yes, please. All right. Five minutes are up. Now we're going to put, you see that the sauce has boiled down a bit. So a lot of the liquid from the uh, tomato has gone down. So we're going to put our rice, mm -hmm. that's the already washed rice, which we strained in the strainer. So we put it now, and then we're going to stir it a little bit, and then we're going to reduce the temperature to 250. All right. Mm -hmm. And add our broth. This broth, we're only using one pack because, it, like we said earlier, salad master does not need too much liquid. Mm -hmm. It cooks with little or no water. The only thing that he uses liquid for is rice or beans yes. or any grains or pasta. But if it's just vegetables, you don't need all this liquid. Wonderful. So, and then you can add your bay leaf at this point. Mm -hmm. And we're going to slice some tomatoes to garnish, I mean some onions to garnish it when it's cooked. Wow, on top, on top, on top of the yes. cooked rice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I'm just stirring now to make sure that the seasoning and the tomato Sauce goes in very well. Mm -hmm. I'm going to cover it now, you see? Okay. And then we're going to put on the timer again, the mm -hmm. temperature. At this time, will be 250. Okay, 250 degrees for Fahrenheit. how many minutes? For about 30 minutes. 30 minutes and our jollof fries is prepared. Now, 30 minutes are up and we are ready to check on our delicious Jello fries. Mama came, do the reveal. Ooh. Okay, what happens? We have some onions on top. Yes. So I'm going to mix the onions into the rice. Mm -hmm. When did you flavor. put the onions? I put the, the onions like five minutes before the end of the 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. So now, now we're, we're going to mix it. it. Okay. So you have nice crunchy onion and your jello fries. Also, if you want for variety, just get the mixed pack of carrots, peas, and sweet corn. Oh, I love you can that. And add those also. I love that. Right? I want vegetables for in my rice. Yes. Yeah. It's very for vegetarians. That is good. That's really good. All right. Thank you. Thank we you. will enjoy this jollof fries cook in our electric skillet made by our Mama Kate. So thank you, Mama Kate. Thank you. And we hope to see you uh, again soon in, at Naomi's Corner. Right. Thank you. Thank you, Miss Naomi. Enjoy! <laughs>